Oh, oh, yammers, arise ye yammers, oh, oh, I am, the yammers ring, oh, we, I'm going to do some of your names like you're in the intro to Elden Ring as I see them go by. <coughs> Harukio. The frog gif poster. Why is that open? The thanker of gift subs. Rise. Rise. Frog house. The one who's a frog house. <laughs> They're all here. Oh, rise, arise. Luminous B, the one who's sick. You you stay in bed actually, because you're not well. But the rest of you arise, arise, de rise. D you de rise back into de -rise. the bed, and the rest of you arise. Hi everybody, welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. We're here again with more Elden Rang. Yep. And I feel like boy, they should have put an Elden Ring on it. Are my arms tired? Yeah. Your clairvoyant friend has played over a hundred hours of Marvel Snap, and it's my fault. That's fair. Here's it's it's pretty hooky. It's pretty hooky. What's your question? All right, bear with me here. Okay. Think about it. Think about it really hard. The fit ring. The El Elden fit ring. Do you mean ring fit? Yeah. Elden ring fit? Yeah. Is that what you're going for? Elden ring fit. Elden ring fit. It's two things. Yay. <laughs> she said two things. I did. I, it's like the... The... It's like the Wheel of Fortune before and after. Yeah. Elden Ring, Ring Fit. Yeah, you're right. It is like that. Nice. That's good. Um, we're playing more Elden Ring today. But before we get into that, we got to read some subs. And while we're reading subs, I'm going to run a three-minute ad break. Ah! So everybody get ready for some ads, and I'm going to read some subs, and then we're going to get into the damn old game. So here come the ads. Ads are running. Ads are running. Yeah. And here come the subs. Here come the subs. Do, 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 do. Is Julia inebriated? Never. Julia doesn't get inebriated. Nathan just raided us. Thank Nathan, you, Nathan. Thank you for the raid. Nathan. Nathan, I have a joke for you. Wait, I have to read the subs. Elden Ring fit. We got subs from <laughs> Mooncandy525, Kate Dice, The Gayest Minotaur, Grab a Go of Bones, every time, Hollow Love, Tabasco Cat, The Fruit Bat, Minion Bus Driving Me Nuts, Mob MP33, Baker Street Babe 98 gave out five gifted subs, aka Nicole, Madeline Clementine, Sculter, B Opossum. Nathan said uh, Elton Ringfit is very good. Yeah, you got the Nathan approval. So I did a little yeah. Uh, Hollow Love gave out five subs. Stitch to Fur, Zerui, Dyson Cube, Really Lord Gwen Vivo, Real Lord Gwen Vivo gave out ten gifted subs. Thank you so much. A Bagel One Forty Five, Modest Mouse Potato, Ancient Asparagus, Dimion, Lipstick Switch. Nope, Lipstick Witch rated us. Thank you, Lipstick Witch. Floral Felidae, Vibing Apples, There and Jack again. Sucra Baroque gave out five gifted subs. Chemicult gave out two subs. Sunrise gave out ten subs. Fine Sunny Day, Lulz Laurel. They Them Blend, Keen Garu, Spicy Batch, Superhuman Foods, The Fut Bucker. Professor Rad gave out five subs. Savannah Jean, Matician James, Vibing Apples, Jamathon. SpongeBob Michaels, Reaver Royale, Risk of Game, Cheery Dogu, Fatback Gaming, 
Nivelstreams, Streams, Shoestring92, Koala Tums, Blue Danube, Neo Doken, Gradient Jump Scare, and Baked Beaned. Thank you all for the subs. We appreciate it. I was using that time to show everyone things that are on my desk. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I never know what to do while you're reading subs because I don't want to say anything, obviously, because, you know, you got to, like, kind of keep up the momentum. I mean, I think it's good to give them a visual. It's a, This is a visual medium, so. Yeah. This is an audio-visual experience, so I think it's good to show people things. I got a little box of batteries. What do you think about that? Is that good? What do you think about? What do you think about that? I'm seeing a lot of people who are psyched for the horse. Horse, horse! Oh my god, I can show them. Oh yeah, yeah! Bring the horse. We can show you a real life horse. So you can get a sense of the size and scale. He's so big. Of this bad boy. Horse, 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 horse. He's a pretty chonky dude. He's uh, big. This fella. He's big. If you were wondering why he costs $45. Um, I use because him... he's the size of a human torso. And my head, actually. Yeah. <laughs> this is like my, my hip bones here. Yeah. Uh, I use him as a pillow sometimes. He's a really good neck pillow. Oh, so good. Flip it over. I need to see if there are eyes on the other side, too. Are on the ready? other side, he is just a turd. Turd. He's just a long turd, turd with turd, legs. Turd, turd, turd. Which I turd. think is pretty good. A fun thing also with this horse is when you scrunch it. <laughs> he really <laughs> looks like a turd. He gets really wrinkly when you scrunch him. He's he's big. He's wider than me. He's He's this tall. You can hug him. He's so soft. Ooh, ah. You can see, you can see it. You can see the reversible softness. You can see his little, his little mane. His little shaky mane. Best part about him now, his little feet. His dangly little legs. The original one that they made, the prototype, had like stuffing in here. And we were like, no. We were like, take the stuffing out. Make it little dangles. We want the legs to be little. We want them to be completely worthless. Yeah, I use them as a pillow a lot. <sighs> he's really good for that. It's actually like... Perfect neck pillow. He's so thick. Look at that thickness. He's so thick that when you like put some weight on it, that's like all my force to squish it. That's like, there's still some, there's still a lot of squish there. There's a lot of squish to give. You can buy the horse at DFTBA, our, our Drawfee merch store, which is only at DFTBA. I know that there's a rogue merch store out there, but that's not us. There is a false one running wild. Be wary yeah. of false merch stores. Don't fall prey to their tricks we and traps. We only sell merch with DFTBA. Who's putting their nasty sword in my face? Hold on, look at it. Oh, they went away. They went away. They put their nasty sword in my face. Um, let's play Elden Ring, huh? Let's play Elden Ring. How about that? So we're doing an all NPC run. We're yes. gonna meet them all. We're, we're going to do every quest line. That is the goal of the stream. Um. Okay. Oh, and I will tell people we are going to be doing some summoning today. The first place we're going to be summoning, and we have a few things to do before I get there, but the first place that we're going to be summoning is the Limgrave Tunnels. So if you want to go to the Limgrave Tunnels and prepare to be summoned, that's going to be the first one. But for now... We have a new friend to go and meet. When we last left off, we had just talked to D because he had sent us to meet the beast cleric. Mm -hmm. And um, now we have somewhere else we need to go. We are on PC, yes. We are on PC. We need to go to... Do you have to set up the thing or is it set up already? What thing? The, the thing that lets you team up. 
Oh, um, oh it is, it's set up already, but I will show again so people know. Joy, I really, you can't be on my lap right now, unfortunately. You want the chair? Um, the multiplayer password you see in the top right, it's Yammers with a capital Y. Um, so put that in your multiplayer password slot so that uh, you can get summoned up into my game. By the way, you were correct about the strength. I do like it. Isn't it nice? It's it a nice. it's a Montauk Easy Riser Belgian White. You picked good. Okay, time to go meet a friend. Not that giant. Joy's here. Joy uh, is feeling good because we've had the windows open and the humidifier on. She's scratching her ear. Ignore that. They're going in for their yearly next week. I see someone asking how long they have to get the Jacob horse until they sell out. And then we probably we may do a restock depending on demand. Mm -hmm. Oh wait, here we go. Is anybody there? Someone who might be interested in rescuing the great Kenneth Height, servant to the True Order and celebrated repudiator of the false. Oh, I love that his name is Kenneth. Grant me soccer. I love soccer? this dude. This dude is so stupid. Hello. Is anybody there? I'm Someone I'm right here, bro. Bro. In rescuing the great bro. Height. I'm right here. Ah, you come to lend me your aid, have you? Well, that's that's very kind, but um No. No, the help is very much appreciated, even from a tarnished. This dude's racist. Despite what the appearances, hell? nobility is no prerequisite. All right, we can just not help you. Order. You might have heard of me. Kenneth Height. Next in line is the rightful ruler of Limgrave. Young Tarnished. I would have a boon of you. I want you to take back my fort. It lies to the south, beyond the Mistwood. <laughs> he looks like blonde Ted Cruz. From <laughs> to him, a fool and plumb bad to boot. You're doing it's Kenneth Height a disservice. Oh, you know what? I was actually wrong where I told you where, where to go. We're going to do Fort Height before we do um, Limgrave Tunnels. So the Fort Height Grace is where I'll be summoning from. What are you waiting for? A kiss goodbye? Maybe. I mean, that'd be My nice. fort lies to the south, beyond the Mistwood. Take it back for me. Oh, I see. You wish to know the reward. Fret not. The great Kenneth Height is known for his considerable largesse. The celebrations will be lavish indeed upon the dawn of my fort's retrieval. I love his flowery language. I know. He's in this like ruined world and he's still being like a princely little mm -hmm. shit. He's still like really talking a big game. Yeah. Hmm, yes. Now allow me to furnish you with a little advice. I would take great care to avoid Godric's tarnished hunts were I in your shoes. That depraved lot are obsessed with sacrificing tarnished like you for the sake of grafting. Honestly, Godric's nothing more than a jumped up country bumpkin. Lord? Oh, don't make me laugh. First, he hid himself amongst the women folk to flee the capital, then hid from Radan in that castle. Then he insulted Melania, lost to her in battle, only to lick her boots rather than die like a man. <laughs> Has he no shame? The big girl's blouse. Maybe he's into licking boots. He's the blood of God. He's a little sicko. The last of the golden lineage. Though you almost wouldn't know it to look at him. Yeah, I almost feel sorry for the chap the more I think of it. I really like when you talk to him because I missed him the first time I played. Mm -hmm. And so when I got to Godric, who's the first like big boss. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, what a scary, intimidating guy. Yeah. If you talk to this guy's first, he's like, man, that guy's a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let me tell you about all the ways that man's fucked up. Yeah. Go beat his ass later. Well, this guy's also like, my fault. Okay. he seems a little delusional. Yeah. This is the dude that I really liked when I saw him, right? Cause he's like, he talked a big game. And yeah, he's a very silly fellow. Yeah, and he's like in denial about what the world has become. Yeah. Touch grass. I feel like my volume levels 
are not. I want loud voice, quiet everything else. Yeah. Okay, next we are heading to get the map of this area. Eh, eh. Close enough. Gotta go through bear forest and bat forest. Excuse me, bears. People are talking about the frames? Shouldn't be dropping. Oh, my frame rate's bad? Okay, hold on. Oh, yeah, it does say skipped frames detected. Why? Let me check my settings. Let me check my settings. Where's my... Are we sinking something? Can't I shouldn't be, be sinking anything. Um, as always, the game is not chugging for us. It's chugging for you. Apparently it's our webcam too. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, because that's oh, when see. it's, you know, the, the issue. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, remember yeah, the yeah. issue. Yeah, 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 yeah. It has to do with the, um, the refresh rate. Where's the refresh rate? I think it is back. I'm like swinging my hand to see. Yeah, let's see. Is this better on full screen? Looking better. Yeah. Seems good. Okay, now we go south from here. We'll see if it... Um... Yeah, so everyone's saying better. That's looking smoother, isn't it? Give me this. Give me this. Give me your beast bones. I just remembered what that noise is from. And then we hear the howl over here in the ruins. And if we look up, you can see at the top of the tower, there's a friend up there, but we can't speak to him yet. Mm -mm. We must continue south. Southward. Southward ho. Southward. That was so bright. Excuse me, friends. Who the heck is that? Oh, is that one of the dudes that leads It's a little you? ghost. I would talk to him, but there's a bunch of beasts coming at me. Yeah, oh, I do want this though. Thank you. Birdly. All right, so I'll be doing some summoning right over here. At this grace. <laughs> you can't call someone a southward hoe, that's rude. <laughs> Listen, I calls them like I sees them, okay? Listen, you can be a hoe and be moving southward. There's no shame. There's in being no a shame hog. in that. Who wants to join my merry band? We will summon these blunts. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Immediately. Who wants to join my merry band? Whoa! That's a big sword. That's a big sword, my friend. Um, Can't wait to learn your name in a moment once these blunts are here you are namulith come and join me namulith hello these blunts oh, hold on yes there we go i'm so glad that that's become a thing you must welcome namulith oh of course yeah, <laughs> let's go. I'm glad that I've contributed something to, you know, the souls like runs forever. All right, everyone. It's time to take Fort Height They're for our own. Such cool outfits. And you're out here wearing a potato sack. Yeah, I'll have a cool outfit later. My, my coolness is in my utility, not my luck. That's what I say about myself. I need this. Who wants to die? Dun 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 dun. Bazinga! Nice! Whoa! Oh, we got Golden Vow. That buffs the party. Hello, sir. Welcome to hell. 
Y'all go fight. I'm going to grab this item real quick. Hello, sir. There they go. <laughs> you can see the power of my flame and stab combat style. Yeah. Few can resist the power of flame and stab. Every time you look up to see what these two are up to, these blunts Ooh. is just rolling through like Sonic. Giving us a little heal, thank you. This rat's invincible. Um, devs? Oh! <laughs> Did that rat catch fire? I think, um, Namalith has a fire enchantment on their weapon or something. Damn. What's up, gamers? Let me turn on my lantern. I don't have a lantern yet. <laughs> Never mind. I'll turn it on later once I have it. Ouch. Na, 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 na. Oh, you got a lantern, Dee's Blunts. Thank you, Dee's Blunts, for Thank being Thank you, more Dee's prepared. Blunts. Yeah, let's... <laughs> Dee's Blunts, help. I was about to say, let's not explode. And then we absolutely exploded. Dee's Blunts got a little lit. Got a little lit up. Shit's a little lit here, to be honest. Mainly because everyone is always throwing fire. True. Take a little cookbook. Why not? Stop throwing fire! I say with no hint of irony. Yeah. In my voice. All right, let's top up. What? Why are you looking up at me? All right, we're about to fight a boss, so I'm gonna buff up. Flame is gonna grant me strength. Ouch. Ouch. Big ouch. Don't worry, we got this, gamers. Stab his ass. Get his ass. Yeah. So this, in case it was unclear, this is um, Kenneth's height, Kenneth Height's fort that he wanted us to come and get back for him. Can't believe these blunts celebrated and you didn't celebrate too. Oh, they both perished. What the hell just happened? Oh. Well, it's an invader! You piece. That was scary. Oh no! You got this, Namalith! <laughs> Namalith, get him! Get him, Namalith! Get him, Namalith! Get his ass! Get his ass! You got this! Oh. <laughs> I had other things I needed to get from there. <laughs> Not anymore. I wasn't done in there. Alright, we're just gonna do a, a speedy... We're gonna do a speedy grab. Joy just looked up at me. Joy looked up at you with the, yeah. the sweet face? Yeah. She looks up with the tiny eyes and the teeth hanging out sometimes. People with cats, you ever look at your cat? Hey, hey cat, hey cat, hey cat owners. <laughs> you ever look at, you ever, you ever look at your cat's little teeth? You ever look at those things and you go, it's so little. The cats are so, their teeth are so small is the thing. <laughs> for some reason, my splits are frozen. Oh, they sure are, huh? Your, uh, your whole time thing is, is not going. Gonna have to fix that. Un momento, please. All right, live split is completely frozen. I love having problems and issues. It's good. It's good. Just close it. Just, cl just, just close, close it. it. Oh, it's, it's frozen. Just close it. Just close it. Just close it. 
Just close it. Did you guys all see the worm? The Heidi Klum worm. It's a good worm. That's I, all I got to say about it. I had to make it get closed. Julia's been talking about this worm every day. It cracks me up. It's a good worm. I'll give you that. Thanks. All right, let's get it back to where we were going. Wow, you did this run so so fast. Everything within a second of each other. Yeah, I'm pretty. I'm pretty fast. Okay. Back to the game. Okay, so next, you remember we heard that howl and we saw a friend on top of the roof? Yeah. Oh. In, in order to follow up on that, we got to go back and talk to Kale. Kale is the one who's going to have info we need. Kale. Good old Kale. What is this pod doing? What are you doing? Wait, weren't you? Well, you're back. Care to buy something? Why did you say that? Because we left? Did he not there expect us to come back? Of my people who yet survive if the mood takes you when you meet one. Then offer them some trade, won't you? I think he expected me to be like dead or something. If the mood does take you. The grace of gold, which is why we cannot settle, but instead are forced into this pitiful, unceasing journey. But thanks to that, things are not so different for us now, though the Elden Ring is shattered. <laughs> I think this makes us kindred spirits of sorts. Everyone is calling Bobby him Santa. Yeah, because he is. It's red and white like Santa. Tell me about the howling in the mistwood. Why not? The howl of a wolf in the mistwood. I suppose he must still be skulking about. I know. Why not meet him for yourself? Next time you hear the wolf's howl, make this signal right under the source. Oh, don't fret. There is nothing to fear. I just have an inkling the two of you might hit it off. Goodbye for now. And with that, we get the favorite gesture of all Final Fantasy XIV fans. If you know, you know. The finger snap. Ah. I know a fact about wolves. He please, was, please tell me. He was saying some wolf facts. I have a wolf fact. I hear from a very reliable source that a wolf hunts for its prey. <laughs> <laughs> That's just a Hanzo quote. <laughs> It's a Hanzo quote that annoys me every time I hear it. I go, yes, Hanzo, we know. Tell me something more interesting about the wolves. No, that's it. The wolf howls on the roof. So if we go around here, we can see him drop down right, right next to us. We come over here, we give him the snap. That's the map, not the snap. We give him the snap. There he is. Hello, big husband. This is big husband. Yeah. Normal husband, big husband. And look, we're Dickfoot too. <gasps> we are. It's match made in heaven. Who goes there? Carly sent you, did he? Oh, his voice is so nice. Never the bloody busybody. Hmm. Maybe to him you don't seem so strange. The name's Blythe. I'm looking for a man who goes by Darrowell. He fled somewhere nearby. Or so I've heard. Come tell me if you find him before I do. I can offer you ample reward. Darrowell is nothing but a traitor and in need of a fitting end to his tale. Darrowell is nothing and in need all we know about him right now is that he's big, he's sexy, and he hates Darrowell. So we hate Darrowell. So we hate Darrowell. Um, in other news, my, my live split froze again. 
It seems to not like the fact that my game is going full screen, which makes the frames work better. Why? This wasn't a problem the first time, though. The frames were fine the first time, right? Yeah. So I don't know what's happening. It's okay, Joy. You're okay. It's gonna be one of those streams, y'all. One of those streams. Why is your mouth open? Okay, there it goes. It's good. Tiny mouth, tiny mouth. Gonna have to force it to close again. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Then we open it again. All right, maybe I'll just... get as much of what I need to do on screen. That's what I'm thinking. As I can. All right, that's a pretty good bit. Um, by the way, the next place we're gonna be summoning is Limgrave Tunnels and that will be very shortly. So, I get, think, get your ass ready. I think I'll ask yeah. people who have been summoned already uh, to maybe hold their horses. Yeah. And not join the pool. That yeah. that would be nice, yes. Just so we can get different people in. First we have to go back and visit our good friend Kenneth Height and tell him what we've done. Was that? It was. You are correct, chat. You do not have your horses yet. I'm sorry. But imagine if you had them. You can hold them. How you would hold them. No one to hold them. No one to squish you, you them. You can fold them, too. You can, yeah. Hello, Kenneth. Ah, I've been waiting for you with bated breath. Did you manage to recapture my fort? Oh, excellent news. Just wonderful. And the knight's dead to boot. Well done, my friend. Well done, indeed. I knew I was right to trust you. Now, here's your reward, as promised. Go ahead. It's all yours. A handful of berries. Oh. He gives us the Erdsteel dagger, which would actually be good for our build, because it's a dagger that scales with faith. Mm. But we're going to be specifically using a different dagger that is good for critical stab damage. So this dagger will not be our dagger of choice, unfortunately. Right then, time for me to head to the fort. I've much to do. First, I'll have to reestablish communication with the demi-humans. What's that look? You don't believe me? Well, under the Erd tree, co-mingling with the demi-humans is made possible. Even the vulgar shall not be left behind under the rule of true order. Which is why I, Kenneth Height, next in line as the rightful ruler of Limgrave, have sworn to uphold it. Just you watch, my friend. Just you watch. I love how Kenneth Heights like, listen, bro, I'm not racist. I'm friends with demi humans, okay? <laughs> Just because they're vulgar and subhuman doesn't mean I can't be friends with them because I'm not racist. I'm doing them a service, which means that I'm not racist. Ah, yes. Uh, I only see them ask, as beneath me. <laughs> would you like to enter my service? I see bright things in your future, stout warrior. Do you like cater Enter at events? Enter my or? service and learn the workings of the Erd Tree's true order. And who knows? Perhaps sometime down the line, the grace of gold will return to those tarnished eyes of yours. What say you? A fine accord, is it not? We have to say yes to this for the quest. Just know that in my heart, I would not pledge service to this man. Unless I just wanted to see what was going to happen. Very well, very well indeed. I knew I saw something in you. I shall await you at my fort. We shall hold a ceremony for your knighting there, I think. I see great things ahead of us. We are truly by the Erd Tree blessed. Right then, time for me to head to the fort. I've much to do. First, I'll have to reestablish communication with the demi-humans. Here's my take on Kenneth Branagh. Right then, I've much to... Yes. Kenneth Branagh 
No, Kenneth Height. <laughs> yes, Kenneth Height. Kenneth Height is the kind of man who would find nothing wrong with the song Do They Even Know It's Christmas Time at All? What? <laughs> That's my take on him. What does that mean? But also, you're right. I had to think about it. That would be his favorite Christmas song. The song that's like, your Christmas doesn't look like my Christmas and that's sad and pathetic and we should fix that for you. In that you don't get snow and your practices are not exactly my practices. Kenneth Hyatt cries every time he listens to the Christmas shoes <laughs> song. Yeah. He weeps openly. Yeah. Uh, we're going to Limgrave Tunnels now, so if you'd like to be summoned for Limgrave Tunnels, meet me at the Grace for an ass beating. Kenneth Height invested so much money into those go gold Trump coins as he thought they would be actual currency at some point. Also, I tapped your shoulder before because Joy... Uh, sometimes gets a little whistle in her nose when she's sleeping. and um, But when she was snoring with that little whistle, it started off low and went... Mm, yeah. Mm, like, it, it just, like, went up a note every time. She was making some cute little noises. It was cute. For sure. Okay. Let's get it going. And who are you, might I ask? Wow, what is that? Beefaroni! <laughs> Related to Pepperoni, of course. Oh my god, I love the headgear. What is that? It's like a weird Honey head comb? cage. Yeah. Whoa. Oh my. All right, we'll get you next, Antlers. Everyone put their mark on like remarkably the same spot. Remarkably? Hey. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Uh, this makes me happy. Oh, it's the U Maiden. We played with the U Maiden uh, before. Yeah. I feel like your out your your drip's gotten better. Yeah, absolutely. Let's get the U Maiden in here. Don't worry, it's just a car. It's just a car. Joy, I'm so excited to bring you to the vet because the vet's gonna go. Ooh, you so healthy. You so healthy and doing good. Other than being nasty, you're healthy. Other than being a nasty little freak who refuses to kill the fly that's in our apartment. The U Maiden, hello! Yes! I always do that. I give you a little one of these. Yes! We got this. Let's go, gamers. This is a pretty short dungeon, so it should only take mere moments of our time. Oh, hello. Because these guys are particularly weak to this. <laughs> Just lighten them up, yeah. They don't like being lit on damn, fire. Damn, oh, Okay. They also don't like being blasted. No, they don't like that either. And uh, help me see all of these to collect. Yes, we'll do. Because we're here to collect smithing stones so we can upgrade. Upgrade weapons. I don't even need to be here. Give me a little bit of that action right there. Thank you for your lanterns. I don't have one yet. You've been invaded. No! By squid face. Stop invading! All right, we gotta move. If we move quickly, all right, I think there's some stuff. Maybe there's not some stuff. <gasps> oh no, Beefarani, you fell! 
Squid face! Oh no, squid face. You piece of shit. Welcome to hell. <laughs> See you in hell, squid face. Victory. Uh, Dragon Blitz, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome raiders. Thank you so much. We just um, annihilated a foe. Through spamming the big firewall, that thing. We love the big firewall. Firewall protects us. I hate dogs. In the game. I was about to say, you and I are about to have beef. <laughs> Why'd your spear like bounce off? Oh! They've got like stone skin. Oh, right. Okay. So unless you do like a power attack, it bounces off. I love that you just push that guy into a pit. Oh, there it is. Left. Excuse me? Right there. Oh. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right. So now we have to go back up the elevator. Oh, here's a little sum a summonable. Fred Glintstone. <laughs> <laughs> Good thinking, Fred. Joy is so flat. Yeah, she's been wanting laps today. She missed her, her morning time. Bro, I came from the raid and didn't even know Jacob and Julia streamed. Welcome! <laughs> Welcome to our stream. We stream over here we stream, twice a week. Yeah, at Wednesdays least. and Sundays. Yesterday we streamed a bonus stream. Fred Glenstone. What a oh, cool I, stance. I love this gesture. It's so good. Oh, we'll be getting that one later. I didn't realize it unfolded. It takes so long to unfold. That's what makes it so good. Well, my favorite is this thing. Yeah. Because of the, the two people. When that person raided that other person's map and the two people did it from other parts of the map looking at each yeah, other. Yeah, it's really good. Uh, so we're going to be jumping off this elevator halfway. Fred Glenstone, you maiden, you know the drill, right? Make sure you hop off at the right time. <laughs> Whoa, oh, there they are. <laughs> All right. <laughs> The they lag just, there made me sad. They popped it into existence. Jacob, Julia, you are my favorite streamers, and I want you to know that. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, you may have done some damage to our friends here. <laughs> yeah, when you light them on fire, they explode. It's a fun little detail. Good work. Good work, everyone. I like where you, the one where you curl up in a pathetic ball. That's oh, look at his good. beautiful glintstone light. Oh, oh Fred. It's beautiful. Yeah, I'm gonna let y'all take care of this so that I don't cause any um, damage to you or your loved ones. We always do the hop downs in case there's bonus materials. You made in like some red in style. Like, look at this, a somber smithing stone. Oh, We're going to be needing those as well. Know. We're going to be running one weapon that is somber and one weapon that is not somber. And also we got to level up our uh, talisman. And somber is one of my least favorite characters to play against. Oh, there's Overwatch. a thing over here. All right, who's ready to kill a giant? You twitching? Flame, grant me strength! Chat loves the joke, Julia. Thank you. They're very generous, this chat. Do, 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 very do, kind do, to do, me. Do. I think this, this guy's problems would be solved. Ah, 
I don't think there's any solving the problems he has. No. His problems are, are too big. I was going to say, if he ate a Snickers. Oh, he looks because less, he looks hungry. He looks hungry, and he's a little grumpy. Great work. The ring. Thank you. Thank you, contributors. Thank you, collaborators, for your help. Let's go ahead and add the ring. It's so slow. I love that. I'm such a big fan of. <laughs> it's imbued with intense meaning. It's so good. Okay, let's see. What's next? Next, we have to go and visit another new friend. So many new friends in Limgrave. Mm -hmm. Limgrave is a place for friends, just like MySpace was. When is Elon going to buy MySpace again? Or buy MySpace to make it profitable again? Where's that? Where's that, Elon? Make MySpace a place for freedom of speech. Everyone is so happy with what you're doing with Twitter so far. I love it. I feel like you've really been nailing it. You've really improved the world by letting everyone say exactly what they want with no repercussions or lessons. Pretty good stuff. Pretty good. So here's one of the, the caravans. You can, if you kill the giants or one of the giants, they'll stop moving and you can get the trazior from the back. But we're going down in here. You and I got stuck here. We, we did together. because it's hard. It's easy to miss where it goes down. Yeah. And also the freaking plants are always doing garbage. Yeah. All right. We have to fight a hamburger man. The hamburger. Oh, God. Good golly. That shouldn't be allowed. I agree with you. I didn't mean to do that. Give him a stab. on this burger ain't flailing. The uh, ham, but this is a hamburger though. With so much flavor, it'll really knock you upside of the head. A hamburger so good. Julia, please. <laughs> there we go. You'll wish it killed you because every meal afterwards will be a disappointment. <laughs> <laughs> He's just a little bit of a pain because uh, his hamburger head gets in the way of the spells. Yeah. I'm just trying to keep, you know, the the chatting up and I'm keeping the no, jokes no, rolling. I appreciate while, it. I appreciate while Jacob it. Jacob can focus on the fight. I think I couldn't have done it without you. I could have said helpful tips like you should use the pepper snuff. But That's true. You could have done that. Yeah. Here's another friend. She has a big head mask. I do Hi, like this lady. Dally. I wonder you should turn up here. And bare feet I around all those crystals. A sorcerer quite plainly. It's dangerous. Why are you here? I want to learn sorcery. Ah, a yen for glimstone sorceries. A yen for glimstone sorceries. Unless your proclivities are far sorceries. from ideal. Oh well, perhaps nurture will defy nature. With a bit of luck. But one must choose one's masters wisely. 
I was exiled from the Academy of Rea Lucaria as a reviled apostate witch. Do you still wish to learn from me? I want to learn from you even more now that I, I know you're an that apostate you're witch. <laughs> well, you are a piece of work. Very well. You are now my protege in Glimstone sorcery. But I refuse to coddle or cast kind words. Never. Anticipate grievances, young apprentice. All right, so we can buy spells from her if we were a spell caster, which we're not, unfortunately. So we'll leave and we'll get nod in thought. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Did they fix that whole lady's deal? Yeah, they fixed a lot of the quest lines. Oh, cool. Uh, nod in thought. Hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Maybe we want to run ads now. This is probably a good time to run ads. Uh, we'll go ahead and do our three minutes of ads. Uh, and then we'll come back and keep on playing. Here we go. Did y'all vote yet? Hey, y'all vote yet? Hey. Y'all do any <laughs> voting yet? Hey, Chet. Hey, Chet. Y'all. Y'all do any voting yet? Oh, we got so many who said I did. Oh, I'm, I'm actually, that genuinely makes me happy. So thank you. We did too. Yes, we did. I got. You got the proof? You got the evidence? You want to do webcam mode? You got the evidence? Look at that. Now you can't tell us we didn't. We also got um, this pen that I didn't know we were allowed to keep, so I handed it back to the lady. I found a pen I'm allowed to keep. It fills me with such joy to see people have voted. It was Rafey Rafe's first time voting. Hey, congratulations! It's Some people not are not so 18 yet. That's fair. But once you are, you'll be able to do it. And I encourage you to do so. It's, uh, it's so nice to feel or like to see that, you know, how many people have voted because I feel like, you know, backed up. I ain't showing up alone. It's nice. Yeah. But you should try, um... Microsoft 365 family. For I don't free. think I'm going to try Microsoft 365 family for free. Thank you, though, Microsoft. My husband just became a civilian and we voted together. Very nice. A citizen. I said civilian. <laughs> citizen. <laughs> I thought you meant they left the military. <laughs> I was like, I don't see what that has to do with voting, but, you know. My dad became an official citizen so that he could vote uh, against Bush. <laughs> Get him. Get him, Julia's dad. <laughs> Was he a vigilante before? <laughs> <laughs> he was an assassin like Keanu Reeves. Any tips on moving to NYC? I would have no idea. I'm sorry. But Jacob. Um, I mean it it's probably it's I would do it different now than I did it but then. Mm-hmm. Because then I just went on Craigslist, found an open room, sight unseen. It, uh, it actually insane to me. And um, was just like, yeah, I'll just live here for the first month. And then once I'm there, I'll be able to look around and see, you know, where I want to actually move to. Mm -hmm. So that was what I did. I did a sublet. So that yeah. is an option you could do is to do a sublet and... Um, but if you're moving with your husband, you probably will want your own place. Yeah. Because you're not like 25 and single. I guess if you're like moving to <clears> New York City and that implies that you're like not from New York or the area, I would say some big tips for new New Yorkers. Don't hang out in Midtown, not because it's scary, but because it sucks. No one's in danger of moving to Midtown. Because it's impossible to afford to do that anyway. I don't mean like move to Midtown. I mean like don't hang out there because it sucks. Um, I would also say be ready for every kind of weather. Have a really good winter jacket that covers your butt because you get really 
crappy, like wet ice snow combos. And you don't need that on your butt. That's my big tip. Talon Dahl said that's white male privilege, Jacob. It wasn't white male privilege. I talked to the woman I was renting the room from on mm-hmm. video chat before I went. And she was my age and very friendly. So I, you know, I could understand that even if the room was subpar, um, probably this 25 year old girl was not going to like stab Silly. me or something. Yeah. I work in Midtown. Listen, everyone works in Midtown. That's why it sucks. There's nothing fun in Midtown. There's some good food. It just sucks. My mom used to work in Midtown. There's not even good food in Midtown. What are you talking about? I mean, it's like fine. There's no good bars. The food in Midtown is like worse than anywhere else and the bars are worse than anywhere else. It really is awful. It's a horrible place. Like you want to eat at the freaking Applebee's? That's true. Then you can do that. Was I 25 when I moved to New York? Yes. I moved on my 25th birthday. That was my first day of work at College Humor. And now I've been here for eight years. That's right. I've been here for 33. That's not impressive because you never left. Yeah, it's actually like very not impressive because I've never been anywhere else. (laughs) (laughs) I've never lived anywhere else except for New York. Uh, let's play. Yeah. The game. Yeah. The video game. Oh, also, if it's going to rain really hard, maybe don't go somewhere on the subway. And I mean, like, really, really hard. Because sometimes they flip. Anyway, let's go. H. Spanky said East Midtown, where all the Japanese businessmen are, has some dope Japanese food. Yeah. That is true. If you go, the further you go to the East or the West... Yeah. You will find better things. There's like good Indian food, like just southwest of Times Square, I think. All right. K-Town is over there too. Yes. I mainly meant in like the, what's known as Midtown area. Like Times area. Square. If it has another name like K-Town, that means yeah. it was known enough to not be called Midtown anymore. That means that it was good and they didn't want to be associated yeah. with Midtown. <laughs> Midtown sucks. I would avoid the Wall Street area. That also sucks. Again, not because it's dangerous. New York is a pretty safe city, but just because it like sucks, it's boring. Yeah. Um, so, Worms. as you recall, our large husband Blythe wanted us to fight Darawill and kill him. Mm-hmm. Darawill's in here. He's in this jail called mm-hmm. an Ever Jail. So we're gonna go in here. Summon up our boy Blythe, and we're going to beat Dara Will's ass. Because he's right here waiting for us. Our first fight with our husband. Oh. We'll be looking at the scrapbook of this later. That's the kind of fights you should have with your husband, where you fight together. Yeah. Rotting in a cell is no true justice. No. This is where it ends for you. Damn right, gamer. Why don't you grant me a little strength? You know, just grant me a little strength. Draz said fun couples activities to do with your husband. Get toasted, gamer! Oh, I heard the stagger. You can't hit me. I know all of your moves. You hit me. I'm gonna give him a little touch. Boop, boop, boop. (laughs) Damn, Darawell's so tall. I gave him a little touch. I gave him my famous hot touch. Hot hands. Hot hands. The hot touch is one of the funniest moves in the game because it actually does really good damage and is really fast, Mm -hmm. but it looks like you're doing nothing. Yeah. And then their health just goes bam, bam. Yeah. Hello, husband. Ah, right. There you are. Had to work for it, but it's done. Don't say I'm not a man of my word. What do you mean you had to work for it? Here's your prize. You flipped out of the way of his sword like once, and then we set him on fire a lot. Yeah, that's true. Thank you for the somber stone. Oh, yes. I should say. 
If you venture north to Rio Lucaria and come across a venerable blacksmith who's a little on the large side, tell him I sent you, and he'll be sure to treat you right. Oh, I that's the guy. Dragon. That's the guy I thought you were meeting last stream. And now he's not until later. What? That's There's so many blacksmiths. It's time we parted ways. My husband doesn't like small talk. That's enough chit chat for now. It's time we parted ways. He's very business focused, yeah. and I, I love that about him. Stoic. Okay, now we're going back to the Bridge of Sacrifice. Ooh, what we sacrificing? Oh, you know, our Poles, time. Am I right? Our time and effort. Give me a little bit of that. Uh, you'll recall this is where we talked to Irina. Yeah. Who wanted us to go south to Castle Morn and give her dad the letter saying, Daddy, please, please leave the scary castle and come protect me. I'm sitting on a rock in the rain. Yeah. So we will be going to find him, but we have some things to do first, believe it or not. Big. Give, give me the flower. Gotta do some, do some dog dodging. Pick up a little smithing stone two action. More erd leaf. More like turd leaf, am I right? Oh my god. Wait. It's too far away for me to reach. I was gonna reach for the horse. There's a knight's cavalry. You can kill him if you want to get a flail, mm -hmm. which is a pretty fun weapon. But we're not gonna be doing that. It's not our business what he wants to do. There's also a merchant over here, but we don't need to talk to him right now either. What we do need to do is get some more spell slots and there's an easy way to do that right up here. Whee! At this, like this tower. beautiful tower. Unfortunately, the work we have to do here to get the spell slot is, um, people aren't gonna be pleased with me, I will say because it involves murdering ghost turtles. <gasps> Everybody close your eyes, look away. Think happy thoughts. Think happy thoughts. One is there, one is hiding in the bushes. And then one is around back in the lake. This one's invisible. So you have to look for its footsteps. Found it. That was a big footstep, damn. I guess they're already dead. They're already dead. You're like, you're freeing them. But also they're not like doing anything. You know, they don't deserve this treatment. Hey, what's up? It's your girl. What was her name? Uh, Geraldine Slay. Geraldine Slay. Nerd. Oh, I thought you were going to say more. No, that's a quote from Ghost Files. Oh, like you're talking to the ghost. Oh, yes. Yeah. I gotcha. I'm with you now. Yeah. Mimmy Stone. Mimmy Stone. Now we have another spell slot for use later. I was a little scared. Yeah, me too. <laughs> uh, okay, now we go back here. Grab the map fragment. So we can see where the heck we're going. My quarrel is not- ah! <laughs> My quarrel is not with you, sir. His quarrel is with you. You may not have quarrel with him, but he is one with you. He can't jump up here though, so it's fine. Yeah, fall damage in Elden Ring is like, Whee! you're either fine or you're dead, except for that case. It is like pretty lenient. Yeah. But I do like that we fell all that way and it was like, no problem. But if yeah. it had been like a foot further, you it's instant death. Yeah, yeah, that's what I mean. The golden sea. You're fine or you're dead. All right, now we're gonna run. This is Castle Morn. We're not gonna be doing it just yet. Very cool visual though. Um, but we are going to go ahead and come up here. 
Surprise that man has not tried to shoot me. Do I have a favorite episode of Ghost Files? I've only seen the latest season. And I really like... You fool. Why was his health so low? Damn. You were a fool to stand near me. I will take your golem great bow. I don't know why he didn't aggro. That was weird. <laughs> that was He's wild. never not aggroed me. Julie, it's the only season. But you know what I mean. They had other ghost hunting episodes before. Uh, I do like the first one. Though. I love when they go into the... Into, like, the, the body shoot. And he's going, kill me! <laughs> also, Jog King... <laughs> Jog King. What was the thing that th that he said in the recent episode, where he was like, "I'll tell you, I'm dead." <laughs> it like came through the ghost box. <laughs> yeah. The phrase was like, <laughs> "I'll tell you." Oh, let me tell you. Yeah, let me tell you, I'm, I'm dead. dead. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, all right, he's really leveling with me here. Yeah. Uh, what am I doing now? Oh, I didn't get the map. I had one job. I absolutely love when they put on the headphones and say whatever they hear in the thing. Job rule. <laughs> Let's get the dang map. We've not started the latest season of Owl House yet. We have not, no. We have to catch up. Yeah, we do. It's on the list. We're knocking out a few Halloween-y things right now that yeah. we didn't get to. Like Cabinet of Curiosities. Guillermo del Toro's Big Adventure. Yep. Okay, now we get this flower, of course. It's time to go to Crazy Town. Who's excited to go to Crazy Town? Me! Raise your hand. Me! This place around here is the Ailing Village, and it's your first encounter with frenzied enemies. Oh. Enemies that have gone crazy from the frenzied flame. Oh, we want to know anything. See, about the, the rats have golden flame. eyes. Some people say I have golden eyes. I don't think... Because I'm so good at seeing shit. I don't think that, that people do say that. Yeah. And they, they will. You see they're burning each other, which is not great. Yeah, certainly not. There's a little choice over here we want to dip into so we can grab There's a the lot Flame of, of Frenzy here. spell and a Sacred Tear. And then I've we leave. I've never seen this place. I yeah, I, I didn't come here first playthrough. I, I missed it entirely. And then there is a site of grace over here. I think my favorite place, or one of my favorite places, is that town that's between the that's in the, like the the fjord sort of thing. Yeah, the village of the Albanorix. Yeah, I think I like that place a lot just because how of how we found it, which was just by like. Yeah, you don't you don't expect to. Get a little, a little cheeky little level up in there. All right, next. Uh, and did I say already that Castle Morn is where we'll be summoning next? Castle Morn is where we'll be summoning next. Castle Morn is where we'll be summoning next. Oh, there's a little jumpy spot over there. Yes, but we will not be jumping there. Oh. That is not for us to jump. It's not our place. I see. Uh, what we're gonna do, though, is grab this. Mm -hmm. Not get stabbed by that man. You tried. There's a bit of a choich up there on the hill. Those dudes had roots for heads. Yeah, some people do. That's what happens if you don't oh, get a root canal. Big flowers. You just become a root. 
So if we go around the backside, down to here, we can get the Faith Not Tear. It rhymed. Did you like it? It was good. So soon we'll get the, or we already have the flask of mis mixed physic. Mm -hmm. And this, when we put it in the flask, uh, boosts our faith stat when we drink it. So it's another thing you can drink to make yourself buffed. I love that. When you're going into a boss fight. Hello, bats. That's why I drink five hour energy. Five hour energy. I've never had a five hour energy before in my life. I have. Really? Yeah. Why? Because I was doing overnight shifts at the front desk of a dormitory. I see. That does make sense. And I had to stay awake or else I would get fired. Do you want to fight or what? Well? <laughs> tell me now if you want to fight. Okay. Tam. Toasty bat. And I think, I think Melina has something to say here, if I remember correctly. Yes. Wow. Melina got something to say. Everyone shut up. Melon is talking. You gotta listen to our wife. The old ball and chain. <laughs> Spoken echoes of Queen Marika linger here as well. Shall I share them with you? Yeah, okay. I'm interested. In Marika's own words, then... After thy death, I will give back what I once claimed. Return to the lands between. Wage war. And brandish the Elden Ring. Grow strong in the face of death. Warriors of my lord. Lord Godfrey. That's what she has to say. Okay. You know, take, take from that what you will. It's kind of like she's reading to us from the Bible, essentially. Yeah. She's like, here's a pat, my favorite passage from John 2, 12. It's called Footprints in the Sand. It's called Footprints in the Sand. You only see one footprints is because America carried you. Yeah. I realize um, that I know nothing about Melina. Other than she like shows up and she's like, here's a horse. You're my wife now. Well, she shows up, says, here's a horse, and she says, get me to the foot of the Erd tree. That's why I don't know anything about her, because we got to the Erd tree and... Uh, no, we got to the foot of the Erd tree with her. Did we? Yes. That's where you... Well, I don't want to oh, spoil yes, anything. Oh, yes, okay. Yeah, okay, no. I don't remember. Um, suffice it to say for chat, I got the frenzied flame ending the first time through. Um, all right, I'm going to go fight this big boy. Just do a quick boy fight. This guy's not scared of commitments. He really put his roots down. What are you going to do? Hit me? But you don't like fire. You big tree. He hit me. This is the downside. Some, sometimes, sometimes you kill, sometimes you die, you know? In Elden Ring. All right, one, one more try, one more try, one more again. One more again. I'll be quiet this time. You don't have to be quiet. Well, I just, you know. What are you going to do, hit me? This weapon looks like the thing you use. He hit me. Playing shuffleboard. There we go. Then we give him a little bit of this. Unfortunate. He went for the three fur. Really being good. Well, oh, that was risky. That was fewer greedy like me.
What are you gonna do, hit me? Give him little touches. He's dead. He's dead. He just gives you another thing to put in your... Some stuff to put in your flask. What the fuck? Oh, the game's still going. What? What the hell? I don't know. It's like you're... Display is like disconnecting or something. Disconnecting and then causing things to freeze. Oh, chat froze. Chat froze. God fucking damn it. What is this new problem we have? I don't know, man. I could just pull it up on my phone. Can you refresh Chrome or is it? I can refresh Chrome. Chrome. I don't need Streamlabs. It's fine. Except Chrome is um, Chrome is completely frozen. I'm pulling up chat on my phone. On our screen, everything has frozen except for Elden Ring. This happened in the last stream, too. What is going on? I don't know, man. I love it when there's just a new problem yeah. that didn't exist, and now you can't figure out why it suddenly exists. I think that's cool. Everyone's saying they're still here. People are saying we're so cold because they're frozen. Chat's frozen. Nice, I get it. Yep, yep. Um, okay. Elden Ring hates Chrome. That's very possible. The problem is... I don't know... Oh, no. It... <laughs> Streamlabs is frozen. What? I can still control it through my stream deck. What the hell? I don't know if I'll be able to end the stream if I don't. Well, we'll just uh, force quit everything. All right. Well, I guess I'll just keep playing then. Just keep trucking. I'll try to figure out what's causing this issue before next stream. Just a brand new problem. Yeah. That's fun. That's cool. Oh. oh. Okay. Did you turn on the drop in soon screen? I did accidentally. Okay. Yeah. People were saying where are we drop in. Yeah. Oh. What the hell? It came back. Streamlabs came back. All right. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> it's really bizarre. Anyways, what am I doing? You might ask. The answer is, I'm going to church, and I'm switching to gameplay cam. Take me to church. Oh my goodness. Is everything okay? Yeah, I got a, I got a cute photo of my niece. Oh, okay, good. So it's not a, another problem. She's got her favorite pillow, her favorite blanket. She's got Elmo on TV. She's drinking milk. She looks so happy. I'd be happy too. She's got little little princess PJs on. Mm. The life. Y'all, I love being an aunt. I wish I could see her more, but she's perfect. Listen, don't put that pressure on her. Right now, she's perfect. If she messes up, that just means she's more perfect. Big she's turtle. She's got flowers. Big Bell Turtle. I like how Big Turtle waited till I got over here to start moving. Yeah. Normally Big Turtle's already moving. I think some... <laughs> some stuff's happening. I think some stuff got a little jostled in the old system. You okay, Big Turtle? You you going normal? You doing normal? He's just doing like a steppy. We're gonna go around these ghosts. I have no quarrel with you ghosts. Bounce. And we'll get ourselves another one of these. And we'll sit here and then... And we'll upgrade our flask and, and maybe even talk to Melina again. No, Melina doesn't want to talk.
Oh, I should mix my physic. Joy's little nose whistle. We want the opaline bubble tea on there for now. I'll take the opaline bubble tea, please. No <laughs> please. Ice. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to go down there. No. I always make the mistake where I forget to take the beacons off my map and then later in the game I just see a beacon and I'm yeah. like, where the hell is that beacon? And I can't find it. I think Turtle's just stepping. Yeah, Turtle's stepping, but he he normally like... Walks around. Well, he is walking around, but I'm saying he's normally always stepping. Yeah. And he was not stepping as I approached. Yeah. Which was new. Look at the clouds. That's beautiful. Clouds look so cool in this game. Yeah. Here's a little moichent. And he's an important one because he's the one from which we may buy a lantern. Well, there's been an age since I've seen a customer. He's got his face covered completely. Oh, I look a little grommet. Grommet! His little, um, the, the, the fluff on the bottom of his hat looks like a little larva. You know what? It's something I learned recently. What? You see like the feathers in the merchant's hat? Yeah. If you get like their notes, uh -huh. the feathers of the note will match the specific merchant that wrote the note. Oh. The feathers on like the bottom of the note. Oh, that's fun. Isn't that neat? That's cute. Have a safe journey. That was in like a Vati video or something. Uh, let's equip the lantern. The lanterns. And now it's Castle Morn time. So I will be summoning for Castle Morn. So meet me at Castle Morn if you're not afraid. Meet me at the Castle Morn lift site of grace. Did you get rid of the beacon that was at the, the merchant just there? It's gone. Okay. If you walk through it, it goes away. Oh, okay. Hello, Joy. Oh, no, you're okay, buddy. You're okay. You're was this okay. the one last time where I had to like walk in before I summoned people? And it was like a problem? Uh, I thought that was like a cave, but you might be right. You know this game better than I do. I don't remember. I remember things based on vibe and vibe alone. And then you remember like incredible specifics of details of things. Hello. Oh my goodness. Jim Halberd. Hey, Jim Halberd's back. <laughs> From the office. Didn't we play with Jim Halberd last time? Seems familiar. Joy had a big, um, like twitchy, twitchy moment when, and then her head like fell. And her mouth was open and she was like fighting something. So I was waking her up because it was freaking me out. I'm sorry. What? What? I can't two hand my spear. All right. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Jim, I would do the thing, but I can't two hand my spear. What's what's the little nutcracker on the left? That's my my uh, talisman. Mm. So what's in my left hand? Uh, can you not two-hand it because you have the talisman? No. Just trust me on this. The controls are not working is what I'm saying. It's Shigglemoss Dips 1. Beautiful. Believe me when I say that I know how to two-hand a weapon in the game. I can two-hand my left-hand weapon. But I can't two-hand my right-hand weapon. Weird. What if I unequip it? I can't do it. I can't do it! I can't do it! I'm sorry! I'm so stupid. 
Every time I open the map instead of the menu, I hate myself a little bit more. <laughs> Excellent posing. Very good. What a good team. Is my attack button? Oh, my attack button's not working. I can't attack. <laughs> I can't attack. I'm going to replug my controller. Was Joy on the mouse or something? I can R2. I can R2, but I can't R1. That's okay. I don't need it. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> the stream saw how excited Jacob was to play this game and decided to throw every wrench his way. That's what it feels like. I can't believe how disastrous it's been. All right, let's do it, gamers. Castle Morn. Jim Halbert and Sugar Moss Dips. Sugar Moss Dips. Y'all are gonna really have to carry. I still got hot hands. How did that man hit me after he was dead? Hello, dog. I swear to God. I swear to God! That's dog. Dogs are the worst enemy of any video game. Yeah. Woo! Did a little twirl. Somebody come kill this guy. You've been invaded. No, don't invade me! How about a little of that action? Be careful, Jim Halberd. Don't invade me, I don't have an attack button. <laughs> My attack button doesn't work. Give this guy a piece of my mind. Somebody go stab him for me. Oh, good, good backstab, good backstab. I can do this. He has health? Is he just up? Oh my God, what has happened? Oh, oh there he goes, okay. It's a little delayed action death. This is a disaster. This is very funny. Why is this happening to me? How could this happen to me? <laughs> Your game's haunted. Nope. We got a little frozen. We got a little got a little cozy there. We became a part of one another, me and Shigelmoss. Shigelmoss dips. Oh, Hello. I'm running. Those creatures, the faces, really look like the mom from Resident Evil 7. Yeah, you're not wrong. What the hell? What the hell is that? Boiled. Did the invader come up here and drop a bunch of boiled crap? Oh, the invader's right there! Hi! Oh, emote. <laughs> Hello, Glump. Uh -oh. Are you gonna fight us? Oh, he's wearing the. Oh, oh my god! No! <laughs> no! Y'all, we don't have an attack button! You can't escape my flames, Glump! <laughs> <laughs> he's too good! Get him, boys! Touch him. Touch his ass. He's too slippery. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Wow. It's a lot. I love the very human voice coming out of Glump. Yeah, with his like turtle head. Yeah. Oh God! This dude's out of his mind. Get him! Stunlock his ass! <laughs> Don't let him heal! 
No! I'm like out of mana. Oh my god. Clump, you die, bro? Oh no, you're just running. We never give up. We cannot abandon our friends. <laughs> Ohana means family. <laughs> I'm not falling for it, Glump. Forest Glump. I'm gonna give you Mama's touch. Mama's touch. I've only got one more touch. I'm out of touches. You're out of touch. Get him! Get him! No! no! Are you kidding me? Stop healing, Glump! How many heals you got, Glump? Can't be that many. You need mana to do these things. Yes! Yes! Victory over Glump! Glump defeated. Good work, team. Excellent job. Good job, everyone. Good work. Good cooperation. Way to stick together. Jim, you're, you're mildly poisoned, but... It's alright. You know? Oh, you're flame cleansing yourself. That's good. Oh, and a little oh, heal for everyone. Thank beautiful. you. Thank oh, you. thank you, Jim. What good friends. Well, I'm completely out of mana. But I will still go talk to Irina's dad if it's the last thing I do. You have no mana. But I have two friends. You can only hold your weapon with one hand. <laughs> and and can, you can only heavy attack. I can only heavy attack. Why is this such a weird problem? <laughs> <laughs> it does look this? like something has happened to your left arm that has rendered it useless. Yeah. This way, gentlemen. Someone said you got mana from the invader. That's not true. Oh, I did. I have a. I have. Oh. I got some flasks. That's great. That is great. Welcome to hell. <laughs> ah. Okay, that guy's dead. They just. They just don't know it yet. <laughs> They're all dead. <laughs> <laughs> they just don't know it yet. It's like, you know, an anime when you slash them too fast and they yeah. don't know. Hello, Irina's dad. Ah, uh, there's a face I've not seen before. I'm Edgar, warden of this castle, as ordained by Lord Godric himself. But you can see how things have turned out. <laughs> the menials have all rebelled. They gave me good service, or so I thought. But it seems it was all an act. Foul creatures, as it said. And true enough, they're foul inside and out. I'm sorry to disappoint you. But whatever you come here to do, I'm afraid Castle Moor <laughs> won't hold much longer. Love the dainty set. Take this, by way of apology. Thank you for the twig. I got a letter for you, my man. <laughs> I see. From... Arena, thank you. I mean, you're dead, but I can't leave yet. Even if the castle should fall, as commander, I must remain to ensure the treasured sword of Morn does not fall into the wrong hands. If you see Arena, do tell her that her father will come for her once he's fulfilled his duty. If you see your Everybody right jump. <laughs> Everybody jump on useless dad. I just want to tell this man like everybody here is dead. Yeah. You are you are servicing a empty and ruined castle before. Like the people that were here were already dead when I got here. But since I got here, I've also killed all of the demi humans. <laughs> so now there's just no one.
Touch a little grace. Touch a little grace. And we'll just, we'll keep rolling with this crew. Yeah. A good crew you have. A powerful crew. Ooh, you almost went too far, Shigglemus. Shigglemus Digglemus. I would backstab some of these guys, but, you know, I can't get him. I'm saving my mana. Hup. Down we go. A little golden ball there, but I don't need it. I don't need what it's got. This will be one of those YouTube videos that's like, can you beat Elden Ring without ever using the R1 button? <laughs> without ever using normal attack. <laughs> because it's mandatory, because your game did a glitch. Everyone be very careful when you're dropping here. Don't miss. Don't get attacked by the dogs. That's a rat. Don't get attacked by the rats. Rats are the new dogs. You okay, buddy? No. <laughs> There's a whip in there if you want it. Hey, anybody want a whip? There's a whip in here. I'm gonna go uh, touch Grace right quick. Mm -hmm. We're not really cutting it hot dog style. We're more like poking it kebab style. Like we're skewering it. Oh. Shigglemus knows. Shigglemus knows where he's going. We gotta go fight a beast man. A beastman. Of ill repute. Uh, let's do a little drinky. Do a little grant me strengthy. Do a little wondrous physicy. Do a little mana y. Everyone chug up. <laughs> I love how every everyone who plays this game does like a million chugs. Mm -hmm. You gotta have your vitamins. Oh no, I granted myself more strength. <laughs> it's not what I wanted to do. You're too powerful now. Give him a touch. Well, now I'm completely out of mana again. <laughs> the rats are going to absolutely hate this, but they don't run the castle, we do. <laughs> I can do some little stabs here and there. Truly bullying this man. I can't, I can't do it. I have no R1. <laughs> I made a whole character based on reposting and I can't repost. Yeah. Thank you both so much, gamers. I hit the wrong button again and I hate myself a little more. I'll give you some triumphant delight on your way out. Yeah. Big wowzers. I like this location. It's very cool. But it, like, knows it's cool, so, like, mm, gotta take Yeah, and look at the view that. they give you of the castle with the Erd tree behind it. Yeah. So cool. I love it. I truly do. Yeah, I am going to um, reload the game. So hopefully I can use my R1 button again. So we're going to do a quick quit out. and see if we can't regain control of our character. All three frames of that was a blast. Was the, was the frame rate bad during that? I didn't see anyone else complaining about it. I 
I still can't stab. I think I have to restart the whole game. Do a, we're going to do a full restart. I oh, know people were saying it was fine. It was all right. I mean, okay. I was watching the, the video and it seemed fine for me. Normal frames. We love normal frames. Oh, he means you went fast. The fight was over quickly. Oh, uh, it was a little bit of a, a little bit of humor. Too bad we're traumatized by issues. All right, let's reboot the game. Hopefully it will reappear on the screen. Here we go. If R1 is still not working, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> it's going to become a challenge run by necessity. We'll have to switch gears to a magic only character. Hey, there we All go. Right. It's back, baby. Can you two hand? All right. Beautiful. All I right. Guess it just got borked when the whole shutdown happened. Yeah, I think so. So now we have to go back and talk to the man again. We have to go speak speak to father. Stabs are back on the menu. Lift? Any day now? It's a tall shaft. Listen, I got places to be, okay? We should celebrate by doing the Julia thing? You're right. Yeah! All right, we're gonna do a, uh, a salty little run through. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. It's just mashing the, the block button, right? Yeah. Yeah. Excuse me. That guy's busy, you know, preparing his dinner. Sometimes one of them manages to fly up and hit me while I'm climbing. Mm -hmm. I like this guy because he's like commentary about what it's like to be. You piece of shit. Like the leader of a place that's too big. And he's like disconnected from the state of the fort because he doesn't go out and see the state of the fort and he doesn't like talk to his I'm really glad you're saying it and also that it's taking you so long to say. Both of the things I think are really good. The way you're saying it, the length of time, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and the sentiment. I yeah, I'm sure I would have filled it uh, with other genius things had I not taken long. I'm no longer bound by duty. I'm safe. Rescued Arena, I will spend my remaining days with her. Thanks to you, I will be reunited with Arena and devote my remaining days to her. Arena has a gentle nature, though. I only hope it remains intact. Correction, Irina had a gentle nature. Thanks to you and devote my Irina as I We gotta talk about the past tense. You were, um, you were too bad of a dad. I, yeah, I like that he said basically, well, I have to wait here so that uh, maybe I'll defeat that guy when actually he's just waiting for someone else to defeat the guy. As if he couldn't have just waited with Irina, you know? I'm sure he, like, intended to do it himself, but he didn't. He should have just waited with her. He said he was a bad dad. Yeah. Whoa! Am I the asshole for refusing Lock to on? hang out with my daughter, to protect my daughter in an unsafe town while I just sat in my fort and waited for my job to be done. I waited for someone else to do it for me. I waited for someone else to do my job for me. Godric soldier gauntlets. Oh, happy day. 
happy day. We got gloves, wow. baby. We're gloved up. Moving on up. All right, well, what better time than now to go and see Irina, who I'm sure is fine. Grab one of these. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, how could this have happened? Wow. It's like we warned you. Who could have predicted this? Who could have brought you a letter saying, hey, come immediately before I get freaking axed? But she took a bite of her bite-sized Halloween candy and oops, inside was this giant razor blade. <laughs> Somebody hit it. Somebody her hit nature it. was too gentle. Somebody hit it in the candy. Rina, how could this be? My daughter deserved better. The fault lies with me. Yeah. I chose duty over my daughter's safety. Yeah. And that is how fate has answered. Yeah. I'll find them. The foul wretch is responsible for this. I'll hunt them down and exterminate every last one of them. Rest assured, Arena, it will be done. I hope this guy doesn't have any other I'll kids. I'll find them. No, no other kids. Okay, because then he's this. choosing a new duty I'll over hanging out. Yeah. And rest assured. Kids. And that's that story done for now. Great. Right. On to the next thing. Let's meet a new friend. Take a little sliver of meat. Why not? A little meat treat. It's like pre jerky. Here's a fella. I like his hat. Oh, you must be the new tarnished. You do well to steer clear of a gill lake fledgling. Dragon roosts there, and it's as fearsome as it is majestic. So, unless you're mad or wish to be burned alive, stay clear of the lake. Don't be a fool. Turn back. Before it's too late. Anytime an NPC tells you Don't. not to go somewhere, it's basically just circling on the map where you should go. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, but we're not going to go here, there, here, there, everywhere yet. Mm -hmm. First, we have somewhere else to go. Um, you remember from the first stream, our friend Bach, who was the little guy who was like, they beat me up and turned me into a bush. Yeah. And took me took me sewing needle. Yeah. We got to go follow up with him. And he's over this away. Wow, look at the beautiful sunset. Uh, I will be summoning at the Coastal Cave. So if you'd like to be summoned, Coastal Cave is, is where it's, that's where it's gonna happen. That's the place. Just gotta ride over here, grab a little, little thing thing. Oh, right, this place. Get me another foul foot for, for later. What's the deal with all these sideways, like, towers? They kind of look like the Coliseums. Oh, like these things? Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're like shattered bits of Coliseum. Which begs the question, wh what happened? Why are there so many of them? What happened to them? Boink. This also reminds you of the Shadow of the Colossus. 
this area for sure. He's not doing so good. He is in like a drama like when you're in French girls. Oh. oh. What are you doing here? You must leave this place at once. They'll rush in and beat you to a pulp. <laughs> you waking up in the morning? You'll end up just like me. <laughs> oh. 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 Alright, so of course we are going to rush in. But first, let's summon some friends. Friend time. Friend time. I got any levels? Oh, I can get a level. Let me get a level. Is Joy having dreams? She is. But I think she was having a nightmare because she like jolted awake and looked at me. Moon baby! Oh, moon baby, I love that. Come join us, moon baby. <laughs> Yo, Bach, meet my yammers. <laughs> I know you're kind of in a situation right now, but I got a couple bros. This I think you're gonna moon, wanna baby. meet them. Oh my God. Look at this freaking setup on this ghost. Good golly. We're gonna summon Kim. Oh, it's Chemicult. Oh, hey, Chemicult. Hi, Chemicult. Oh, so fast. <laughs> dedication. That's dedication. Chemicult has every weapon on their person. I'm excited to witness. I really love Moon Baby's staff. Like, the tip of it has crystals coming out. Yeah. Moon baby's got oh the whole Lusats thing going on. What is this chemical? Why, why do you have so many? That's too many swords. You can't have that many. Don't worry, it's just your sister. Olive's here. All right, let's go gamers. Orange slice is here. Make a chemical chemical. Don't bite at your sister. She just got here. I don't think these fellas stand a chance, I'll be honest with you. I think I think they're in over their heads with this one. Ruin fragment. Does anybody know the band Pretty Girls Make Graves? Julia, where did you buy the orange? Uh, I think we bought it online. Probably at Co or something. Or um, Chewy. I like didn't. Oh, it's because of my bubble. My bubble tea. Oh my god. Good golly. <laughs> so there's another one coming. You destroyed this first one too fast. Where's your friend? There, there he is. is. Messed up dog. It's like a grafted dog. Good name to read. Bang! The band is Pretty Girls Make Graves. Like the quote. And we got box tailoring tools back. Good work, squad. Good work, everyone. Goodbye. You're all beautiful. What's up, Miss Olive? Miss Olive was standing in my lap like this during therapy. She loves to do that. Just standing. She loves to stand. 
we make our way downtown, walking fast. Hey, come here. You die by the spear, then. If this is your wish. You come out here, you get a beautiful view of Limgrave and the Erd tree. And the moon, which is huge. Good colors. You're so orange and tree is so yellow and everything is so blue. Yeah, it's called composition, baby. Ever heard of it? Hi. I know, I know. You want me to cut you some more? You gotta stop kicking yourself in the head. I know, you don't want it on. I know. Is it too tight? It might be a little too tight. It's not too tight. Don't fall for her tricks. She's gonna get out of it. She's like, hmm. So here's the Church of Dragon Communion. I do love this place. It's very cool. There's a dragon here, and if you want to get dragon incantations, you can exchange dragon hearts for dragon spells, but they require arcane, which we are not going into, so we won't be doing dragon spells this time. Maybe at some point in the playthrough we'll like respec and do something else. But uh, who knows? Who knows what we'll do? All right, let's go back to Bach. Give him his tools. You have a very sweet interaction with Bach when you go back to him. I think it's very nice. Oh, what are you doing here? You must leave this place at once. They'll rush in and beat you to a pulp. Bach is so sweet. You'll end up just like me. Here's your needle. Wait. Is that what I think it is? You got it back for me. My sewing needle. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what made you go and do a thing like that? My mum was a seamstress. And that sewing kit was all I had to remember her by. I always wanted to be just like sweet old mum. Then I s suppose I, I can't just curl up and die, can I? You can't, buddy. Fight, you. bud. You're very kind. I always wanted to be a seamster like, like my mum. Then I suppose I, I can't just curl up and die. Can I? You can't, Bach. You gotta live, my man. Live and grow uh, strong. Um, and I guess, I think this is where we'll end it for, for this one, huh? We got a lot done. We did get a lot done, and we got a lot of problems as well. It's all right, it happens. Uh, hopefully by next time I'll be able to figure out what that weird issue is that happened the past two streams. Yeah. Because I don't want that to happen again. That is very troublesome. Yeah. Uh, but thanks for watching, everybody. Next week, we'll be continuing with Elden Ring. And on Sunday, uh, Julie is going to have a new game. Yep. To play. Yep. So stay tuned for that. I have a few lined up. And also, uh, we got all that new Drawfee merch. Yes. On the store. There's lots of things there, not just the horse. We got posters. Julia made posters out of some of the Drawtectives posters, which turned out really cool. Here's horse. He's so big. There's some very good stickers that Karina made. We got a new hoodie, a zip up hoodie. We have a baseball tee. We have a baseball tee that says draw freaks on it. Uh, it's a lot of fun stuff. So check it out if you want to buy some merch and, and thanks for, for watching and for hanging out with us and, and we'll see you next time. Yeah. Oh, um, Patreon bonus stream Friday. Patreon bonus stream Friday. Bye.